So what's up, man? It's your girl Juan Win here at Maya's Treasure Box. About to drop these for my Gemini. So if you got a Gemini sun, moon, ascended, rising, or Venus, this is for you. And so, you know, I did my little pre-shuffle with my own, with, 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 with my dad, my personal dad, you know, these smoking words. By the way, I'm sorry, y'all. You new to this channel, keep it mind, you know, like, I'm going to let you know, like, I got a lot of different personalities and stuff. I'm going to paint you a picture, okay? I'm going to paint the picture. Only you can put it together, but I'm going to paint it. I'm I'm going I'm I'm to I'm give you a good abstract of the picture, and only you can put it together because you the only one know your story. So, but my, my Gemini's, if y'all, if any of y'all was dating a person that, the nose itch, when my nose itch, they'd be like, message, if y'all was dating a person that ever passed away, or if y'all got somebody close to y'all that ever, that passed away recently, not even recently, but period, whoever this person is, it's like, this person never left you, and this person is like, always around you. Some of y'all may feel it, some of y'all may not feel it. And it's like this. Everything that stink ain't dead. And just because it glitter don't make it gold. You, you got to walk by faith and not by sight. My Gemini's, a lot of y'all are waking up to a higher level of consciousness. Congratulations. Don't it feel good? I'm trying to tell you, boy. It feel good. But let's see what we got going on. Y'all know we got this We got this new moon tomorrow. We got a new moon tomorrow in Aquarius. Y'all look. My Gemini's. Some of y'all. Yeah, y'all, some y'all done went through awakening and it feels good, doesn't it? I got my gym, look, my Venus is in Gemini, so my maybe my love life done went through awakening too. I can feel it too, because I've been I've been chopping heads. I'm a Leo, that my Venus is in Gemini, I've been chopping heads. My Gemini, let's see what we got going on, Somebody from y'all past trying to come back and offer y'all this love, right? I don't know who this person is. So y'all dealing with this person. Y'all probably been trying to even juggle it. Or y'all could be juggling a person that y'all could already be dealing with. That could be a concept. Whoever it is, it's not been a lot of communication between the two of you. Maybe you want to go back and offer them that love or they want to come back to you or they juggling you. Y'all put it together. But whoever or whatever this situation is... This person is toxic for you. They toxic. They toxic. This is a wish you had asked for from the universe. You got to make it. You got to really pick and choose your poison. This could be a Virgo that y'all dealing with. Some of y'all could be dealing with a Capricorn, my own Gemini's. Some of y'all could be dealing with a Capricorn. But this person is toxic and you're trying to like, it's like somebody trying to balance it. It's been a lot of back and forth, maybe secret, silent competitions. Y'all been going at it probably past five months, weeks, years, days. Whoever this is, my Gemini, it's like you got options. It's like one minute this person want to be smart. Then they want to be grimy. Then they want to be holy. Then they want to be a thug. You know, they go through the emotions and everything. And But it's like what you thought, you feel like what you thought was a wish come true. You really seeing the devil for what it is. You can see it for what it is. And walking away from this person, yeah, it's going to hurt you. But that's the best thing possible to do with this person because some y'all could be married to this person or some type of legality issue or something dealing with somebody dealing with some type of court cases this person maybe had to leave you for you know like to go do a bid it could be however this may go it hurt it more you know what I'm saying for that to go on to take place but you bossed up but you, you still seeing like Somebody, you, some, you, some of y'all looking through rose colored goggles right about now, and you got to take them off, cause it's somebody else from your past that's coming back around. That's somebody that you've been waiting on. Some y'all could be in a committed relationship and they watching you. Maybe y'all were married to somebody or something like that, and they maybe got locked up or went out of town or went overseas or whatever. When they coming back, they've been watching you, and maybe it's somebody. I don't know. Some of y'all got about three people. I'm just saying my gymnasts. I'm gonna be like y'all when I grow up. Shit. But somebody, come, they coming back with this new offer of love, right? Listen, damn, my Gemini's. Some of y'all might be pregnant, getting pregnant, get fertile right about now. So just be careful. But I see a celebration, a new, a new, a, 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 like a new foundation of love. Or are you guys just not finding love under new management? Now I see some, I see some, I see some marriage coming on. If it's something. 
Either you can realize that. Either you're not paying attention and it's right there in your face. You're not understanding the assignment or either your person not understanding the assignment. Because it's like, if y'all may be opposites of one another, but opposites do attract. And this is coming from the higher ups. Somebody ready to take this leap of faith and go towards it. Like I say, it could be an Aries. It could be an Aquarius. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Whoever this person is, right? But you got somebody else that got something to say. Maybe some y'all, y'all, some y'all, something finna come to an ending though. Something coming to an end. I don't know. Somebody coming back around. Y'all got some business going on. Like somebody coming back. Like some y'all got a business opportunity, or you had a business partner at one point in time, and it probably came to an end. It's coming back around. Some y'all could be dealing with a counselor. But at the end of the day, whatever this is, the situation is, it's like this. Per this situation really made you step up to the plate. And you like really, you got your guards up, but you still got love in you. Some of y'all could be dealing with an arrogant asshole that that feel like they shit don't stink and and they don't even realize like they not as real as they even think they is. They they trying to nickel and dime and all this. They want they. Some of y'all got somebody that's trying to leech off you. They trying to leech off you. They trying to get fortune and fame. They trying to leech off you. And I think y'all know who I'm talking about. Because y'all could have had a little family situation, but in your mind, I mean, in your mind and in your heart, you felt like some shit wasn't right. Maybe you waiting on it to get right. Mm -hmm. Some you probably was waiting on it to get right, but either you or their person that you've been juggling with two people, anyways. But now somebody want to come back from the past, and it looked like the person that's trying to come back from the past, or either y'all trying to go back towards the past. I don't know now, y'all. This is crazy. Listen. This person is very passionate. It could be a Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. This person is very passionate that they are. And it's like, if they are from the past, they've been working on themselves. And they, they you, can blossom, see, you can see the blossoming in it. Or either you've been working on yourself. But I see just... Mm. Some of y'all could be dealing with somebody that probably did you wrong and whatever going on. Y'all got some type of legal act, um, legality issues going on between one another. Or if y'all, somebody was married, it's finna come to an end. If somebody be locked up or somebody just not sleeping at night because they not happy in the situation they in because they got new, somebody told them something. And that they head, they head is just like all over the place. So it's like, okay. The one person got their guards up because they feel like, okay, that's how it go. It, you, the people, they going to come and go. They come and go. They come and go. And then they want to play the victim. It came to an ending because you feel like somebody feel like they don't even realize what they got in front of them. You got to pay attention. I don't know if it's y'all or y'all person. They got Y'all got to pay attention because y'all getting the news and all the information. JLB could be an initial. May, I don't know if y'all can have a son together, but this person, like, this person could be a Leo, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, even Libra, Aquarius, or um, a Gemini itself. But you've got to make a choice. You might got to let go of that childish side of you. You got to make a choice. You've been working on yourself, and you got to let that part go. That's what this new moon bringing in. You got this son, you got to let go of that. However, if you get that childish thought in you, or you go to acting like a kid when you get mad, you got to be honest with yourself. You got to let it go, because right now you stuck. Your person stuck, because this person do want a brand new beginning with you. They want to marry you. They're not saying nothing right now. They're not saying nothing right now for the simple fact of you is what they always prayed for, and that's what you always prayed and wished for, too. But somebody got too arrogant in this situation. Somebody got too arrogant. This soulmate slash twin flame. Somebody got too arrogant in the situation. And and it's like... Somebody said that I don't been through so much. I'm going to just go on and clear this shit while I still got a peace of mind. Because this shit is just not going to work. I cannot deal with this shit no damn more. Like, hell no. Nah, fuck that. I'm done with that. And then the other person want to hold on to their truth. So y'all come to that confliction. It could be Aquarius. Like I said, whoever this is or whatever this is, it was manifested. 
It was manifested. So with that being said, y'all better get it right. Pride and ego make you lose, lose, lose love all the time. I'm trying to tell you now. So with that being said, my Geminis, thank you for tuning in. Hit the like button, hit the share button, hit the subscribe button. Share the word, share the love, share the love. Let me know what you think about it. Whatever you're going through, let me know. I'm trying to tell you. Like, y'all know I'm rocking with you.